Hi, it's Mark again talking about my absolute favorite food in the world, the ahi grilled tuna. Today, what we're going to talk about is the dipping sauce. Once you've selected a really great tuna, then you've rolled it and covered it in your seasoning, and you've grilled it to perfection and cut it, and it looks just like this, what do you do next? This tuna would be delicious just as it is, but I've got a secret, and the secret is a little bit of dipping sauce. The end result is we want to get to the point where we pour a little bit of sauce in a little ramekin like this, and we set it on the plate or nearby, and then once you dip that tuna in that sauce, oh my gosh, you and your guests are going to go crazy. It's a very simple recipe, and you're going to pick up the exact recipe on our PDC cookbook. It's in there on Mark's tuna and my dipping sauce. Just look for it in the back of our cookbook. But let me share with you the ingredients. You're going to start with some low sodium soy. I highly recommend the low sodium because the, the regular soy has so much of a, 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 a sharp flavor because of all that sugar and all that sweetness. I think you'd really like the low sodium. You're going to start with low sodium and you're going to add a little lemon juice, just common everyday lemon juice. And then you're going to take your, your shredded garlic that's already in a, in a jar, just open it up, take a scoop out, dump it in. You're going to take a little bit of honey. I don't care what kind of honey you got, if it's common honey, if it's a fancy honey. A little honey is going to give it just that perfect sweetening. And then finally, you're going to finish it off with some cilantro. Now, I like to put all my ingredients into one of these measurable containers like this. And then I take my my stir or my whisk and I whip it up really nice. And the reason I really like to have this type of, of environment for my sauce is it makes it so easy to pour it when you're ready to serve. And then you've got a perfect little, you know, clean ramekin of your sauce. And you set that sauce right on your plate. And then here's how you serve it. You serve it with your sauce, a little bit of salad or something green, and then you've got your tuna. I promise you, when you take that tuna and you dip it in that sauce, and then you put it in your mouth, you're going to say, oh my goodness, it is fabulous. Remember, you're probably going to spend about $20 for one really nice large piece of tuna. Don't cook all of that tuna for one person. It's really not meant to be a huge meal. It's meant to be a, for a sophisticated palate, a special occasion, and it's very healthy. Cut it into pieces, roll it in your seasoning, grill it for one and a half minutes per side. Never any longer are you going to dry it out. And then cut that tuna into small pieces, dip it in your sauce, and have a fantastic meal. Again, this is Mark from PDC saying thank you for learning how to cook healthy and delicious. My favorite is barbecue or grilling, but I like to grill the crazy, healthy, yummy things. Have a great day.